Well, let's begin the broadcast with this big breaking news coming in at this point in time. Firing along the Indo-Nepal border by the Nepal Shastra Police at Janki Nagar in Sitamadi is being reported. Let's go across to Sham who has more details on this. Sham, uh, what are the details uh, about this firing along the Indo-Nepal border? Well, it's being said that uh, Indian farmers were in the fields when it is being said that all of a sudden the Nepal Shastra Police started firing indiscriminately at these farmers there who were working in the fields in which one person is said to be has to have succumbed to his injuries, whereas two other who have received bullet injuries have been rushed to the Sitamari hospital. Now we all know that there has been some tension along the border after Nepal trying to amend its constitution to adopt a new map. And in its new map, certainly several Indian territory places have also been shown in the map which will be adopted by the Nepali parliament. So certainly of late, Nepal has been siding citing with the Chinese, with China and the PLA, and certain there has been tension because of this. But certainly today there was unprovoked firing from the Nepal police after which uh, the senior officials from the Sitamari district and from the SSB have reached the border. Now there is tension still along the border there. Now Nepal police have also said that Nepal police have alleged that it was stone pelting by these farmers which led to indiscriminate firing. But certainly the Indian, Indian administrator has clearly said that there was no pro- provocation for any of any sort from the Indian side and it was firing by hmm. the Nepal police. In so this was unprovoked farm. firing, Sham. Also, despite the tension, the Prime Minister of Nepal himself has been continuously saying that they are ready to uh, speak to India. There should be a dialogue and it can be resolved through a dialogue, even if we are talking about tension brewing uh, on the new map passed by the Nepalese parliament. But this firing was unprovoked. Well, yes, absolutely, Swati. Now, this it, uh, it's been clearly said that this was an unprovoked firing and all of a sudden, now some sources also said that one person is said to have been forcibly taken away by the Nepal police as well along with them, but certainly it has not been confirmed by the administration that the DSP of Sita Mari Anil Kumar has rushed to the uh, location there along with senior officials of the Sashastra Sima Bal who, uh, the border, who uh, manage the borders at along the Indo-Nepal border. Even senior officials of the SSB have also ra- rushed to the location. Certainly forces from both sides are deployed at the border as of now and there is tension brewing at the border now.